Good evening. Or good morning. Good noon. Or good midnight. Whenever and wherever you're watching this. Welcome to the Sunday poem. Today it's a poem by a very well-known poet of her time, the first California poet laureate and the first poet laureate of any American state, Ina Coolbrith. In case you don't know what a poet laureate is, a poet laureate is a poet who is officially appointed by, for example, a government and typically expected to write poems for special occasions. Ina's work was very well received, both by critics and also by other more established poets and writers such as Mark Twain, Alfred Lord Tennyson and Ambrose Bierce, whom she considered being a good friend until they had a falling out after he criticized her. I think we can say that Ina Coolbrith was a celebrity. But she wasn't the only very well-known person of her family. She was the niece and stepdaughter of an even more prominent person, a person who is still talked about till this very day. Mormon leader and the Church of Latter-day Saints founder Joseph Smith. Ina and her mother left the Mormon community when Ina was a child and they moved to Los Angeles, California, where Ina eventually began to publish poetry. And, yeah, the rest is history. Today's poem is a poem about poets. And it's called The Poet. He walks with God upon the hills and sees each morn the world arise new bathed in light of paradise. He hears the laughter of her rills, her melodies of many voices, and greets her while his heart rejoices. She to his spirit undefiled makes answer as a little child unveiled. Before his eyes she stands and gives her secrets to his hands. <laughs>